Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another video. Today I am going to be installing the uh, Sanwa MXV 3 channel radio, a F Conigi battery pack for the receiver, and I'm also going to be putting on these cool hot bodies dish truggy wheels i will also be installing a traxxas power switch so yeah let's get started by uh installing the radio all right so installing the radio is pretty simple take off that pin open the lid to the receiver box and trace the servo wires to figure out which one is which. So this one would be shift servo, so that's going into the auxiliary port or th channel three, depending on what your radio says. Here's my throttle servo, so that's going into throttle or channel two. And then last one is steering, which is going into steering or channel three. Uh, this servo is super beat up, but somehow it still works. So I'm not going to complain about it. All right, so let's put the antenna through the antennas hole all right so before you put that receiver box on you're gonna put your battery in all right so to start let's put power switch in So now I can put on the little sign. Right. So now I gotta figure out this mess of wiring right here. So obviously, the battery will plug into here. So I'm, gonna, I'm pretty sure it's the red one for Traxxas. So Just had to cut off the end there real quick. So now we can plug this in. Let's put the charge port one into this charge port. Okay. And there you go. So now uh, the goal is to fit the battery in there as good as possible and be able to, you know, actually uh, be able to put the box on and then from here all you gotta do is screw on the box
So now that the receiver box is on, I'm gonna turn on the radio, turn that on. And I am going to center all of the servos. Um, so all I'm gonna do is put my radios uh, settings and zero everything out. I'm going to close this. And then pop that on and screw on the screw. Alright, so throttle works. It's a bit noisy though. Kind of annoying. Alright, so now for the reverse shifter. Let's just uh, center that and then um, put it in. Alright, so now I can screw that one on as well. Alright, now the last one is the steering servo. Again, you're going to want to center it on the radio. And then you're going to want to make sure the wheels are straight. Or at least your steering system, if you don't have the wheels on right, like I don't. All right, so that's how you uh, install the electronics and the radio and the battery. So now all that's left to do is chuck on some new wheels and it's ready to go. All right guys, hope you all enjoyed. I uh, hope this was able to get a couple trucks running maybe. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next one.